here's a little tip for you guys about my ebook for homeowners who don't want to hire a real estate agent. Sorry, that's Miss Belden. For homeowners who don't want to hire a real estate agent and need to sell their home fast. Okay. Here's a little tip for you guys about my ebook for homeowners who don't want to hire a real estate agent and need to sell their home fast. Click learn more to download my seven tips on selling your home without a real estate agent. Yeah, here I guess. Here I'm going to. Is what you say seven tips? Yeah, the title of it. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I didn't use a free year. Um, yeah. Click learn more to download my seven tips to sell your home. Yeah. Whatever the title is. Period. Yeah. 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 So, um, Okay. Okay. Perfect. So here's a little tip for you guys about my ebook for homeowners who don't want to hire a real estate agent and need to sell their home fast. Click learn more to download my seven tips to sell, to sell your home without a real estate agent. Perfect. Okay. So now in the title, in the title, that needs to be short and sweet and, and, uh -huh. and, and to the point. And that is what they see below the video. So as the ad runs in the newsfeed, that title, it's not, it's actually not there. It's not a title above the text. It's actually, mm -hmm. you have, you have the text and then you have that title below the video. Yeah. 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 Right. So, so free ebook for homeowners who need to sell fast or free ebook for homeowners. Um, yeah, it has to be short. So free ebook for homeowners who need to sell fast. Or, or something like that. You know what I mean? Something like that. Um, free ebook for homeowners who need to sell fast. Perfect. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay, so so again, the video goes up on the business page. Then you come over here and, and, and write out that text. You don't need to do it as you're on your cell phone uploading the video. Just wait till it gets here and then come in here because you can put okay. the title clearly. You can write out the text and then you can change the thumbnail. So click on thumbnail to the right and just mm -hmm. choose a thumbnail for awesome that's a good one right there seven tips i love it that's a good one bro really really good okay cool that's the thumbnail so save yep save and then we're good so um refresh the page go ahead and refresh it bam look at that dude awesome i love it okay so let's go into the ads manager and let's just let's run this bad boy so um, not from right here, click on the home, click on as manager on the left. There you go. Perfect. Okay, cool. And then as we come into the ads manager, you always want to make sure you're in the right account. So by default, mm -hmm. it takes you straight to the Ethan Ray. So let's make sure we're in the right account. There we go. Okay, cool. So now and then we may get we may get some error regarding your domain. That's like the biggest thing. And there's a million posts on that in the in the in the Facebook group, um, because that's a new a new a new thing that Facebook is is asking for, which is mm -hmm. which is the, the 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 pixel and the domain. The 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 pixel needs to be tied to a specific domain. So let's see let's see if we end up getting that getting that that notification as we as we go through. So click the green button. And we're going to go conversions. So the other day, we double checked our conversion. We double checked, make sure it was active. We, we checked our custom audiences. So I'm coming in here, assuming all those are good, which we'll find out right now. So click on, so click on continue. Okay, so over here, we're going to go. And here's, a, here's what's, what's very, very important to know. Special ad categories. Because you're in housing, that off needs to be oh, on, yeah. right? So always hit that drop down and go housing. 
and then and then we're good. So now scroll down. And what we're going to do is we're going to do campaign budget optimization. We're going to allow Facebook. Okay, it keeps on messing. Yeah, so it. scroll down. Okay, so we're going to turn this on, the campaign budget optimization on. And then right here is where we're going to go daily budget. So, mm -hmm. so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go, you're going to want to go, let, let's, let's go lifetime. But at the same time, you're going to want to go at least, at least 10 to 20 bucks per day. So, and it's not going to be, it's not going to be for, for long. Like it's going to just be for the first few days. Like you're going to want to like at least four days, at least the first okay. four days. You're yeah, we can, do, we can do 20. Okay, perfect. So let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, Yeah, let's leave it at daily. Let's leave it at daily. Normally I would change it to lifetime. Um, mm -hmm. And in fact, let's do that. Let's change it to lifetime. So we'll go lifetime budget. And then, and then we're looking at, we're looking at, we're going to set it. We're going to set it for seven days, but at the same time, we're going to look at it in four days and make changes. So we're okay. going to look at it in four days and shut off a few ads. We're going to actually set up four ads, four ad sets. Yeah. And, and so what I want you to do is lifetime. I want you to change that to 20 times, 20 times seven, 20 times seven, which we're not going to go seven days on it, but be just, just put it for this, just put it for the, yeah, 140. So just put okay. it for the actual setting. Okay, cool. Now let's go next. Okay. We're good. Cause we'll set the calendar and make sure that it doesn't overspend. Okay, so retrieving your events. Okay, perfect. So there's your there's your custom conversion. We're good. So right here at the very, very top, new ad set. Here's how we want to play this. You're going after homeowners. So so anyone that 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 is that is anyone who is who is who 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 has a specific type of client, we need to know the avatar meaning we need to know who the hell they are. We need to know exactly everything about them. We need to know their likes, what they love, where they, who they follow, where they hang out online, what pages they like on Facebook. Like that type of data is something you're going to eventually start to learn more of your type of client. Who is your type of client? A homeowner. So, so when it comes to a homeowner, where do homeowners hang out online? Who are homeowners following? Maybe mm. and, and, and face and, and this is very, very simple. What it, it, it either it either comes down to a brand or an individual. So if I'm okay. a homeowner, if I'm a homeowner, chances are I probably follow or have or have some type of interest in Home Depot or yeah. in Lowe's or in the major national public publication, which is the magazine Home and Garden. Right. Like or, or maybe I'm into do it yourself type of backyard type of gardening. Right. Like yeah. these types yeah. of things we need to know, like we need to know because that's our targeting. That's our targeting. Um, so we're either going to target, again, an individual, someone who's following an individual. Maybe there's a huge influencer in the gardening space that we don't know of, because like, for example, in the cooking space. I don't know if you're familiar with with chefs or, or or these different cooking channels, but for the past five, 10 years, there's been major, major TV shows around top chefs. Yeah. Like like Rachel Ray, for example. Rachel Ray is that chick that cooks and makes amazing freaking dinners and she has a TV channel. She has a TV state, she has a she has a episode, she has a freaking TV show, right? So if I was into cooking, you know, if I was into that type of stuff, recipes and stuff, I'd probably be following Rachel Ray, right? So if you're targeting yeah. me with some type of nutrition product or some type of health or something like that, you would want to target Rachel Ray because people who follow Rachel Ray are probably into the same type of shit. You know? Yeah. What I mean? Yeah. yeah. So, so that's how you want to, want to, want to, you, you have to know your client. You have to know, again, their interest and, and where they're hanging out. So when it comes to $20 per day, the way you want to break that down is in four different interest targeting. So that gives us $5 per day per interest. So, so, so you'd run, so, so we would run that $20 per day and then we'd have, we target four different interest keywords. And then in four days we would revisit and look at the numbers. 
and 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 in four days you're just seeing which interest looks better we're gonna see which not necessarily well yeah looks better but aka which interest is giving us the best cost per lead Mm -hmm. yeah yeah, yeah. you know and then and then in four days you shut off the other three and you may just Mm -hmm. run with that one Okay. And now, now yeah, we yeah. have all. Now, now we're we're letting Facebook allocate the twenty dollars per day, and and that's when we can just simply go all in with freaking red, put all the chips in, right? Going all on freaking mm-hmm. red, right? So, so that's how you want to play it, and that's how you want to kind of set it up strategically. Is again, we need to know our our audiences, our demographic. So if we're again homeowners, Home Depot would obviously be a a, a target. Lowe's would be a target. Um, any type of gardening, you know, would be a target. So this is where we're going to find out, you know, what 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 audiences are are. Well, first of all, we should already know what audiences are, are are out there, but I'm assuming you don't, and and we'll find out right now because we're going to leverage Facebook, and Facebook will give us some of that data on on who to target. So let's scroll down. So our conversion event, and we're going to change the new ad set names. So that's why I went on that little three minute rant. Because that's going to be the title. Whoever the hell we're targeting, if we're targeting Home Depot, that's going to be the title of the of, of, of this right here. At the very, very top, new ad set. Why don't we just do that? Very, very top. Let's start it right mm-hmm. now. Very, very top. Take out new ad set and put mm-hmm. in Home Depot. We're going to target Home Depot. Anyone who's following Home Depot or has an interest in Home Depot, they're freaking homeowners. So so we'll scroll down. We got We got the conversion event. Go back up, go back up. Let's scroll mm-hmm. slow. Don't you're going way too fast. So, so um, this date right here. Go ahead and 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 change out the date. So make that ad go live. Um, I would set it tomorrow. I would set it tomorrow. I'd, I'd make it go live February second at six a.m. Okay. So that would be for me. That'd be eight. Yes. Well, no, eight. no, no, no. Yeah, just pick, eight. pick. Put six a.m. Put. Whatever, t- what, yeah, it's Pacific time be eight, yeah, just whatever, just sometime that'd in the be, morning. Yeah, that'd be eight my time, but yeah, and then and then just stretch that out seven days. Now again, in four days, we'll okay. we'll look at the numbers. Don't don't even care about the numbers in the first few days. Like on day four is when we'll look at the numbers. You want to do till six a.m. or just through the whole yeah, day? Yep, even six six. Yep. Okay. Oh crap. Okay. Okay, so scroll down. Crap. Sorry, it keeps on going faster than me. Okay, so let's scroll down. We're going to leave it. Leave it. Um, we don't need any custom audiences right now. We're not even going to retarget our intro video just yet. Um, okay. We're going to go down, change locations, and type in your city. Okay. Locations, United States. Get rid of United States and put in your city. Here Yeah, X that out first, and then go ahead and put in. And then what's very, very important is hitting that drop down at the top and, and changing, the, changing the people living in. So people living in this location, not recently, not visiting, mm-hmm. not traveling, people living in. Okay, so we'll leave the 15, just leave it, leave it as is, okay. and then scroll down. And what we're going to do is we're going to um, – we cannot change gender. We cannot change age. That's what you cannot do with housing with this special ad category that we're in detail okay. targeting. Let's go ahead and, and play around with the detail targeting. So this is where we set, we separate and we set up our, our target. So type in home Depot. I think it's under the home Depot. I think, cause I've done this before. I think, I think it's the home Depot. Okay. So hit backspace, go, go back. No, 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 no. Just okay. go back backspace. No, Type it in again. Or the, you want me to type in the too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then hit backspace. Backspace, backspace, backspace. Keep going until you find it, until it pulls down. Um, great, great credit cards. If you go back. Back, huh? I wonder why it didn't pull up. Um, go ahead and try. Just try Home Depot and then hit backspace. Home. Yeah, it's just saying Home Design. 
Oh, go put a P, put a P. Hmm. Yeah, I know, I know Home Depot could be targeted, but at the same time, okay, so then let's leave home, go ahead and go hit backspace, backspace, backspace. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's under home. So home improvement, home, yeah. um, home repair, you know, um, click on home mm -hmm. improvements, click on that home improvement. So now here's, here's how we'll play this. Again, this is something you'll start doing more research on and start learning more of, of, of who exactly your ideal client is and, and what their interests are. But these are, are, are great ones to begin with. But once you put in one keyword, that's the, the power word right there, home improvement. Now all you, gotta, all you do for the, for the next three, what you can do is just hit suggestions. So hit suggestions, and now it's going to give us a bunch of power words underneath home improvement. So now we got oh, okay. interior design. Now we got renovation. We got real estate. I don't know if I'd really target real estate, um, mm -hmm. but we got home repair, home repair we home, got home construction. construction. You know, these are power words, home repair, um, home, home um, renovation, home construction. You know, these mm -hmm. are very, very, very good words. So here's what we'll do. We're going to go home improvement. So change the title at the top from the Home Depot, mm -hmm. change it to home improvement. That's going to be the first uh, keyword that we, that we use. So change at the top, home improvement. Okay, perfect. So scroll down. Sorry, trying. So we're good here. We're good here. So automatic placements, go ahead and go down, got the calendar, got the, got the, got the city. We got, mm -hmm. we got home improvement. We got, okay, keep going down, keep going down. We're good. We're good. Okay. So let's hit next. Okay. Perfect. And there's 31,000 potential reach in that audience, which is, which is all you need, man, is all you need. So, so now um, at the very, very top, so we're X gonna go, yeah, X out of that. So the very, very top, change that and go ahead and just put in, put in, um, I mean, put in first video and it's just okay. internal, you know, no one sees this first yeah. video or tip number one or whatever, however you want to name that, you know? Um, and then, so your, your page is right there, Ethan. Um, mm -hmm. And then all you're going to do is on the ad setup, click on create ad and then use go existing use existing post. post. Yep. And then all you're going to do is scroll down, scroll down. Mm -hmm. Let's go down a little further. And we're going to click on select post right there. This one? Yep. There we go. And just continue. Go. Hit continue. And so now we're getting the arrow over here. So scroll down. What we'll need to also put in is your link. So the add button, let's, let's grab your link to your landing page. And that is going to go right there. Okay. Let's go to Kartra. And then I have, um, sorry, I'm trying to, uh, you know, go down and it's not letting me. Okay. Sorry, Mike. No, no worries. No worries. So, hit so the for the thank you page or for the landing page. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Landing page. Whoa. Go ahead and sorry. Okay, so let's grab that and, and then click the add button right there. Mm -hmm. Add button. And you're gonna simply go with learn more and go ahead and paste it in right there. And there's also other call to actions. You know, there's a download one, but but learn more is 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 the most highest clicked on button. So okay, that, go, yeah, with, yeah. go with that one. Yeah. So this one right here, um, call to action required. Your campaign objective requires an external website URL. Select a call to action and enter a website URL in the ad. Okay, so we already got that. So we should be we should be fine there. So scroll down. But what we need to do is this pixel part. This is like the latest one. All domains need to be associated with pixel event pair. So this right here, we're not, this isn't going live until tomorrow. So we're gonna jump back on and we're gonna we're gonna fix this error. So scroll down and all that is for the tracking, but that's the most important. But scroll down. Is that as far as it goes? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, there's, you can go further down. Mm, with this or? Okay, so we're good. So that's the build, build. Yeah, so we're good. Okay, so hit publish. Okay. Let's see if we can. Um, 
get past this error right here. And if anything, we'll jump back on and, and fix that error. But it's just, it's just connecting the domain to the, to the pixel event. So we'll do that. Yeah. We'll do that in a, in a few hours when we jump back on. But let's, let's at least okay. get this Yeah, I'll, I'll just text you. Yeah, we're good. We're good right here. So all we got to do is just, is just get that. Okay, perfect. So here's what we're going to do. So X out of this. Okay. Okay, so now let's, now let's X out of the one selected, one selected, one selected. So here's all we're going to do. Here's all we're going to do for, for the next one. So hit one selected, one selected. Okay, cool. Now go to the left and click mm -hmm. on, and that new campaign, let's edit that name. Okay. Edit and name that campaign. So that is going to be um, um, first video ad. First video okay. tip one, first video tip one, name it just like you named the other one. First mm -hmm. video tip one, and then in parentheses, you want to put conversions. Okay, perfect. Okay. In parentheses, and then and then go ahead and hit publish. Okay, cool. So now let's X out of this. So here's all we're going to do. This is multiple ad sets. This is how you want to run your conversion ads. The, uncheck that, uncheck that, that to the left. And then, and then go ahead and click on the middle tab. And then check that box to the left. So all we're going to do, yeah, here, I could show you how to do this part right now real quick. This is, takes two seconds. All you're going to do is you're going to duplicate. So hit duplicate right there. Duplicate. Okay. And then okay. all you're going to do is go to hit duplicate. Just leave it at one. Duplicate. Click the blue button. All you're going to do okay. is simply change out. Go. You're going to change out the title. So it's not going to be home improvement copy. You're going to scroll down. Home repair or something like that. Yes. So scroll down. Mm -hmm. and all you're going to do is hit suggestions. You're going to hit suggestions. Leave that keyword there because that's going to give you the suggestions. If you delete the keyword right now, you're not going to get any suggestions. Okay, so go be down. Home no, not that one. I'm talking about down. That's just the title. Oh. Go down. So the actual targeting right here. So hit edit on the detail targeting. Scroll down. Detail targeting. Okay, sorry. just one second. Yep. So right there. So before you delete home improvement, hit suggestions, find that next keyword, choose okay. it, and then delete home improvement. And then go ahead and title that the new word, home repair. Okay. 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 Now go ahead and go up, go ahead and go up, name it home repair. And you're not going to publish it just yet. You're going to just X out. So you're going to just X out. Go ahead and just X out. Okay. Okay. So now, now, uh, oh, nope, nope, don't close it. Close. Don't publish. Yep. X out. Okay. Now, if you, if you uncheck the one selected to the right, the blue mm -hmm. one selected. No, 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 no. To the right. The one selected X out. So, sorry. I don't see uh, one selected. So, oh, oh, you're talking about these to the right, the top. to the right, to the right, to the right, bro. So now you have home repair, home improvement. And then all you're going to do is check the box for home repair and do okay. it again and do it again. That's all you're going to do. Okay. So you're going to hit home repair, check it, and then hit duplicate. And then do it again with that third word. That's it. Okay. Okay. Until you have four of them. And that's it. Okay. And don't okay. publish. Just choose that next target. Just exit keyword. out. Just X out. You're not going to publish them until the okay. first ad goes live, which is tomorrow morning. Okay. 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 We'll do. I'll, I'll okay. make sure everything's ready by the time we get on next. Sounds good. Sounds good. Okay, buddy. I'll see you there. See ya. Okay. Bye-bye.